guys, I am watching um Big Brother UK. Ain't nobody care. I'm watching Big Brother UK, the last season. I think it was season, okay, it premiered in 2018, Big Brother. And um Chris, ooh, this accent is not I started crying. Bloody. Yeah? Yeah? I started crying, yeah? Because um there's this young lad on there. He is 18 years old and his name is Cameron, yeah? This is my last one. Yeah? His name is Cameron, yeah? And he was in the closet and he did not know how to come out. Yeah? Yeah? Like he <laughs> he did not know how to say the words. Yeah? So I, I, I need I just need one more yeah. <laughs> One more yet. So there was this other lad in there, yeah? By the <laughs> his name was Lewis, yeah? And um he confided in, in, in Lewis, yeah? Because Craig, one more yeah. <laughs> Body twins, body twins, body 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 twins, body twins, body twins, body 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 twins, body twins, body twins, body 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 twins. What's up, Body Army? Welcome to another book. Happy Monday, guys. Hope you guys had an amazing weekend. Are you okay? <laughs> Listen guys, I got the giggles. You know how much time we try to do this damn intro and I keep laughing? Girl, I don't know what's going on. But <laughs> today guys. Anyway, if yeah. Guys, today we're taking you to Italy, girl. Italy. We got some spaghetti. You sure it's Italy, girl? <laughs> because this is a keto version, girl. I don't know if it's gonna taste like Italy, girl. Girl, today we're trying to go to Italy, girl. We're trying to give you spaghetti and meatball. But girl, I don't know. This is some low carb keto noodles. I don't know. I don't like the texture of it so far. Girl, we gonna see what, what she's giving girl because girl, I don't know if I'm gonna like it. But anyways, hope you guys had an amazing weekend. Yes, okay. ma'am. Thank you for joining us today. Yes, ma'am. We have the coldest water bottle in the building. Make sure you click the link in our description to get your very own. And use our promo code Dehydrated to get 10% off your entire order. I repeat, dehydrated to get 10% off your entire order. Yes, ma'am. Period. Let's see our grace and see what she giving girl. God is good. God is great. Let us thank him for Italy. Amen. You go first. <laughs> bon appetit. <laughs> You go first. So because I cooked it, I should go first. Yes. Girl. I don't like the texture of these noodles, girl. But, okay, guys. So everything on here is keto. Okay? The marinara sauce is has no sugar in it. See, I don't even like how the sauce is mixing with the noodles. It's like the noodles is not... It's not um doing it. Not it's not the effect. It's not marinating into the. Let me just try, girl, because we just we don't know. You try it first, girl. Oh, let me you, you, let me cut piece of the meatballs. I don't want to have. I'm sure the meatballs taste okay. Yeah, if, me, yeah. You can't go wrong with meatballs. Okay, all right. So, okay, and it has white cheddar cheese on top too. These noodles look like. How you do it? I'm waiting. <laughs> take it. Take one for the team. Alright, let me try. It's just an, it's an interesting texture, girl. But the meatball is bomb. Look how she ate that. The noodle have an interesting texture. And this marinara sauce have a kind of citrusy taste to it. 
We marinade on the sauce. I guess it can eat. Yeah, but the noodle though is like you. It's not. Like it's kind of like you're not eating noodles. Yeah, the noodles. It don't have no like. Yeah. I don't know, sir. But the funniest thing is, when I'm boiling it, it have a sturdiness to it. Like it's really sturdy, like it's not getting any way soft at all. But when you put it in your mouth, you don't taste no sturdiness. Girl, I don't know. It's, it's some low carb noodles, girl. We don't know. <clears throat> Here, take a bite, girl. <clears throat> and the, the sauce has some kind of, it's kind of citrusy. Well, I think got a kind of limey taste that kind of Citrus, kicks you. yeah. I don't know, I've never tasted that in marinara sauce before. Because all I did was add a little um no sugar um ketchup in there. That's all I did. And some um garlic. Anyways, guys, what are y'all eating today? Grab a snack and come on back, girl. Mmm. Let me find y'all some motivation. I mean, it's not that bad, girl. It's still Baby, I'm going to be a motivation. I think the meatball bring it together, girl. Truly, honestly. Mmm. She's edible. Mmm. Mmm. Is meatball dope? Okay, so, um, Sayonara. shout out to our girl, Qualita. She's always sending us, like, motivational stuff or inspirational stuff. Hey, Qualita, girl. Um, hey, Qualita, girl, honey. What she, what she don't say? Okay, so this says, um, there are some people out there who enjoy breaking down and damaging souls. Ooh. It validates them and makes them feel powerful Ooh. and alive. So when I say protect your energy, Ooh. I mean it oh wholeheartedly. Message! Carrie, you don't went up into my brain cells and read my mind because I was thinking about the same thing in the bathroom the other night, girl. How you need to protect your energy. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. You can't just be... be Giving good energy to the wrong people. No, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Girl, I was just saying that the other day in my head, girl. Ooh, girl, when I tell you that was a word. Colita, girl. You done hit the nail on the head, girl. Yes, ma'am. Ooh, yes, ma'am. Girl, this is 50-50 for me, this damn um spaghetti and meatball. You know what the spaghetti looks like? Spaghetti. It looks like a... Uh, a flat ironed version <laughs> of ramen noodles before you boil it. Boy, if you don't. Because even the color looks really white. Yeah. So a flat iron version. Mind of you, noodles. the color was very brown at first. It looked Did like. I just say that. <laughs> Mind you, before you boil it, the color the color is brown. It looked like wheat. Oh yeah, you did show me. It looked like and wheat. And it was coiled up, right? Yes, it co it comes coiled up in like circles. I mean, girl, we on the diet. We can't do nothing else, girl. It's not bad. It's not bad. It's not like you eating cardboard, girl, or wood. It tastes. You know what it is? It's because we're not used to um, spaghetti tasting like this. That's what it is. But the meatball is good. Ooh, and girl. the sauce is not sweet at all in any yeah. way. It's more like li a limey kind of. And I kind of like my um, spaghetti and meatballs to be a kind of a, um, a sweet girl. Ooh, girl, what I would do for some. Ooh. Oh, I didn't even give y'all a piece. Oh, y'all ain't getting I can't give y'all none. Oh girl, we be greedy and the food is not even that good. <laughs> mm. I mean, she not all that bad, girl. You know. Mm. 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 She not all so, that bad. for the people who um seen our last video. The one with the um, eating without ruining our lipstick. I see some of y'all asking about where we got the lipstick from, the brand or whatever, and where we got. most of our stuff that we buy is on Amazon. Oh. So if you check our um, essentials, um, life essentials link in our description, you will find both 
the um the lip colors and the gloss the lip gloss because the lip gloss goes over it and i want you nomin you 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 anniversary that's what you nominously no on <laughs> wait what do you <laughs> The votes were unanimously? You won, More yeah. Than, I won, yeah. <laughs> Girl, the word can't come out of your damn mouth. It can. First of all, I don't know why you over there. Why would you say stuff you gotta say it like you're a car salesman, like you're trying to sell a car? That's how you speak when you talk about things. I've been watching too much Moesha lately. That's okay, so the purple, yeah. I must say the purple lip looked better on camera, girl. It did. On camera, you know what it is too is that um your mouth is just big as hell. <laughs> don't do her. Don't don't do me. That's all I'm saying is don't do me. No, it's just that I didn't have my gloss on initially, girl. It looks better with a gloss. No, but the purple was a popping color though. The purple was a cute color. I'm not gonna lie, girl. That shade of purple mm -hmm. was cute, girl. Yes, ma'am. So guys, if you haven't seen that video, go watch it. Mm. It was cute. Mm. Oh. And the creator of that channel is um uh, the creator of that challenge is Sint and Mo. Mm -hmm. So shout out to them. Hey Sint and Mo bro. How you doing? But yeah. I mean it's not that bad. It's not that bad. It's edible. Um they just don't taste like spaghetti. So congrats to Cardi B and Megan the Stallion. Oh yes. Because WAP is number one today on the Billboard charts, okay? This will make it Cardi B's fourth number one, okay? And Megan's second number one. So, some of uh, somebody didn't go number one on the Billboard? No. Oh, wow. Only um Savage Remix. Oh, wow. That's so, yeah, congrats to you girls, okay? And what else I was supposed to say? Oh, girl, I forgot. Oh, and they got the, the it's already went gold because she they got the gold plaque. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Not really. Okay, but um, eating this without a piece of of the meatballs is not it, and your meatballs is done. <laughs> <laughs> My meatball is not done. Compared to mine. I don't um, like the texture of the macaroni. I don't like, yeah. It, it it basically dissolves in your mouth. Like you don't, yeah, the macaroni basically dissolves in your mouth. It's not macaroni, it's pasta. The spaghetti, whatever. Spaghetti. <coughs> yeah, I don't, I'm not. But eating the spaghetti alone with the, the marinara sauce, it don't taste good without the actual meat. Girl, after my meatball is done, I'm done. <laughs> I'm not eating no more of the spaghetti. The spaghetti. Uh-uh, this spaghetti is not gaddy, honey. Mm-mm. This spaghetti is not yummy, girl. No, ma'am. So, I did like that, mm. um... Mm. I did like that. I did watch the Jamie Foxx show. I did like it. The, the Jamie Foxx movie. And it was good. Project Power? Mm-hmm. It was really good. Mm. The concept of the show was good. And I'm glad that it was a black man that was the lead girl. You know? Yeah, it was And that, that girl could rap. What's her name? Yeah. That little girl could rap, okay? I also watched the first episode of a new show that's on HBO now. Um, one of the executive producers is, um, what's his name again? Jo Jordan Peele. Jordan oh, Peele. Oh, okay. It's called Lovecraft Lovecraft Country with um Journey um Journey Smollett is in there. Journey or uh, just it just it Journey that's um um Jesse Smollett's sister. Oh you oh. don't know you never remember Journey? I'm, I'm gonna show you her. I don't remember what she looked like. She, she, you know her? She's a, a, a well known actress. Yeah, her name is Journey. Journey, where's she going? How long is the trip? <laughs> Girl, I don't know. They car crave. Mm -hmm. You know her. You just don't remember um, that it's her. Her. You know her. Oh, I didn't know they was related. Yeah, they're brothers and sisters. Well, I thought that um that was what's the name the uh, um daughter because she kind of looked like um Steve Harvey girl in the face. And I oh oh 
and I oh, don't she kind of look like Steve Harvey? No, but anyways, that show is um, it just started last night on HBO. It is really good. This, I love the theme of it and the writing. It's like they're back in the day when um, you had racism with black people, but there's a twist to it because there is these creatures that are trying to kill them. Huh? Yes, these kind of creatures that are in the woods, but they only come out in the nighttime because they're afraid of the lights. Is it werewolves? It's not werewolves, it's just big old alien looking things Ooh, with, girl. Eyes, with a lot of eyes, but but then they call them vampires because when they bite somebody, the person turns into. Oh, girl, I, I don't know if I can watch it by myself. So the I'm gonna concept need a... of it is really good. Ooh, I'm going to need a man to hold on and to. And it looks girl. like it's going to be a really good show. So I'm... <laughs> I'm looking forward to seeing what the next episode is going to be like. Oh. And Journey acts her ass off. And she, there was a point in the in the show where she had to run. And when I tell you she was running for her dear life, Ooh, she was giving you Halle Berry in that. And in, 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 um, that's how you you run in a horror movie. Or if I girl even call this a horror movie, that's how you run. <laughs> now y'all know, Miss Halle Berry's iconic for running the show. The journey's coming for her title, girl. Mm -hmm. Yes, ma'am. Now, well, if you guys haven't seen that, go check it out. It's called Lovecraft. Lovecraft, um, country. Ooh, girl, sounds, on HBO. sounds scary, girl. Like, you need a man next to you, girl, to hold on to. It's good. Ooh. Let me drink some water, girl. I can't say it. Yeah, it's much better than this, um, this meal that I'm having right now. <laughs> I should say. <laughs> Honestly, truly, I agree. This meal is not it, girl. It's, it's edible, but it's not tasty. Cause I've never had marinara with a citrusy taste. Girl, I ain't put no damn lime or lemon in there, girl. All I put was a little bit of ketchup because we already know marinara sauce is. And normally when I'm doing my- And the ketchup that we have is um, there. unsweetened. So normally when we're cooking our regular pasta, we use- Wait, what is this? We would use, that's the tomatoes from the marinara sauce. Oh. Yeah. Normally we would use regular, um, it's probably that is citrusy. Not really, you know. Normally, we would put a little sugar in our spaghetti on our regular spaghetti with our barilla um, noodles, girl. Is it barilla? Mm -hmm. I think it's barilla in the blue box, girl. But these um, low carb noodles for keto people, girl. Mm -mm. I guess it's more of a mind thing, but I can't eat it by itself. I wonder how it would taste with cheese. Like, I did put a little cheese on top, but. You mean with a lot of cheese? But basically, this don't have a taste. The noodles. The noodles don't have a taste. You know how normally noodles, normal noodles, you will boil them and it will have a taste when you eat it by itself. Uh uh. This is my last bite because this is my last piece of um. What you call it, girl? Meatball. Meatball and spaghetti. Meatball and spaghetti. This is not from Italy, girl. Girl, I don't know where this is from. This is from around a corner, girl. I don't like beef. Me no like key. Mm mm. So I'm going to read something for y'all and I want y'all to tell, um, comment down below and tell me what you think about this. Mm -mm. Somebody wrote this on um, Twitter mm -mm. They um, to Tony Braxton. They Ooh, said, girl. if I ever get married, I want Tony Braxton to sing as I'm walking down the aisle. Ooh. And she, Tony Braxton quoted that um, message and replied, start saving. Wait a minute. So basically she's telling her to start save, start saving from now if she wants to hire her yeah. to sing at her wedding. And people are going in on Tony. I don't think that was rude or anything. That was a rude, but she shouldn't have said that because she don't know the person's bank account. She don't yeah. know how much money the person has. So, so I don't think per se, I mean, she didn't say no. She just said oh, it's gonna be a cute coin. It's a cute coin, which I understand. To get a celebrity at a party, Tony Tony D. Braxton, though, girl, she's legendary. But, but I, I think I feel like the message was just too abrupt. She should have said like she should have said something and then leave that at the end, like kind of. Um, she should have said like um. Um, okay, girl, that would be fabulous, girl. But you know, it's gonna cost a cute coin, right? Like That's that. how she said it, but girl. She just said start saving. She even put like an emoji or nothing. That's how you say it, girl. Yeah. yeah. 
Is that well, we saying? know you cost a cute coin, girl. But well, I could see why people are kind of going in. But I mean, it's Tony Braxton. But she, the thing is, you don't know people's bank accounts. You don't yeah, know this woman could be. This woman, have money. this woman could be a millionaire, girl. I guess everybody do. Well, I'm pretty sure. I'm. You, we all know Tony though. She didn't mean it in a malicious way. Yeah, cause Tony's not like that. But you can't just abruptly say that, especially on Twitter, girl. The girls on Twitter is so savage. Like Twitter is a whole different. Y'all think Instagram was mean? Y'all need to go over to Twitter where they could type. How much characters they could type? They do so much on Twitter, girl. They go on Twitter rants. Not even just that, they have the voice, the voice option now. And then they have them gifts. Them gifs or gifs, girl, they do so much on Twitter, girl. I don't be on there like that. But the Twitter be having the tea, honey. Piping hot. Especially black Twitter. But Tony didn't mean nothing, girl. She did not, honey. Oh, guys, I am watching um Big Brother UK. Ain't nobody care. I'm watching Big Brother UK, the last season. I think it was season, okay, it premiered in 2019, Big Brother. And, um... Chris, Ooh, this accent is not. I started crying. Bloody. Yeah? Yeah? I started crying. Yeah? Because, um, there's this young lad on there. He is 18 years old. And his name is Cameron, yeah? This is my last one. Yeah? His name is Cameron, yeah? And he was in the closet. And he did not know how to come out. Yeah? Yeah? Like, he, <laughs> he did not know how to say the words. Yeah? So I, I I need I just need one more yeah. <laughs> one more yeah. So there was this other lad in there, yeah? By the <laughs> his name was Lewis, yeah? And um he confided in, in, in Lewis, yeah? Because Craig, one more yeah. <laughs> Eventually, they had like a group meeting, yeah. No, and he decided to come out, yeah. And Craig, um, you don't have to say yeah after every sentence. That's <laughs> how the British do no, it. No, you don't have to do it because that's very annoying. Kelly, it's a UK thing, anyways. Yeah. So um, he came out to the group, yeah, and it was so emotional. Everybody was bawling their eyes out, bloody crying, yeah. And um, when he went into the diary room to talk to Big Brother, yeah, when he came out, they surprised him with balloons and things and yeah. And um, his favorite cake was cheesecake. And he was willing to give up all his Bitcoins to get um, a slice of cheesecake, yeah. And they got him cheesecake. And it was a big gay celebration for his coming out, yeah. And he came out on a national TV. It was so touching. I was boiling my eyes out, yeah. And I don't even cry like that. It was really touching, Carrie. Shout outs to Cameron, darling. You're an inspiration to a lot of people. And you don't even know. You did this on national TV in 2018. And I'm watching in 2020 and I'm bawling my eyes out, girl. Yeah. It was really touching, yeah? Yeah. Boy, if you don't... Uh. And that's it for me, Kerry. <laughs> it's so funny because when I watch um Celebrity Big Brother, they're all speaking British, and it's just so. And sometimes it's confusing because they talk so fast and they, the bantering back and forth. But yeah. Okay, it's time for you to shut up. Yeah. Oh yeah. Anyways, guys, I am going to be um, reading a viewer's choice question Ooh, today. Oh, girl, spicy, honey. It's been a while. Yes, ma'am. Let's so, go. Um, so, yeah, if you um, would like to send us a question yes, or want us to comment on a situation mm -hmm. that you're going through or a friend of you is, of yours is going through, girl. <laughs> yeah. Um, send us an e Shoot us an email at askbaddytwins at yahoo.com. Yeah. And we got you. Okay, so this email says, Hi, Carrie and Craig. I hope you guys are doing well through this quarantine. I'm 23 years old from Montreal, Ooh. Canada. Ooh, shout out to all my Canadians out there, girl. Yes, me. I'm big up on the cell. Good girl. Still good girl. I've been dating my boyfriend for five years now. Ooh. We've we've been six years. We will be six years in September. Ooh, girl. About a month ago, my boyfriend has... Wait. 
about a month ago my boyfriend has come see me we went for haven't no it's not haven't has come see me <laughs> we went for we went for a walk and we went to mcdonald's to eat we were eating oh. we were eating and i saw my boyfriend looking at two girls oh, oh. who were prettier than me oh. and i felt very jealous oh i i don't sometimes i don't feel i feel uncomfortable sometimes i feel uncomfortable with my own self oh um after a while he told me he was looking at the girl's hairstyle honestly i don't know what but what it, what to do anymore my question is um was i wrong for feeling jealous um first of all girl i'm gonna let me start off he's looking at her hairstyle first of all girl i don't think so he is not a hairstylist why are you looking at different um hairstyles and textures and and no he is lying to <laughs> that was that's a lie <laughs> that was a good comment but to be girl, honest but... though i don't think you should be jealous i feel like all all guys do that but yeah oh listen guys are not blind okay they're gonna appreciate a beautiful woman my thing is though you need to feel beautiful within yourself okay mm -hmm. the fact that you said um two other girls that's more attractive than you no girl girl you should be the most beautiful person in the world to yourself Period. Yes. So you, you have are. to start with you first. The jealousy is coming from you because you're a bit insecure about your your person. Everybody your, has their own your physicalness and their own beauty. Okay. Yeah. Find what your beauty is and own it. Okay. Yeah. And um, I don't think you should be jealous. I don't think guys look at women all the time. Yeah. It doesn't really mean anything. Well. To a certain extent. And I'm pretty sure he does it way more often. You just don't always catch him. Like, guys are just always looking. You know what it is? Now, if he got up and went over there and started a conversation, that's a whole different thing. But he was not looking at no damn hairstyles, girl. He is not a hairstylist, girl. He is not Arrogante, Tokyo Styles, or, um... Alonzo Honor. Or Alonzo. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. So, I don't know why he looking at hairstyles, girl, like he trying to put it on a different client. Girl, no. You get what I'm saying? But just be more confident in yourself, girl. Mm -hmm. Okay? Just be confident, you know? Maybe it's coming from, maybe you're a little bit insecure when it comes to your boyfriend. Don't be that way because, yeah, that's gonna, that, and if you display that, that's gonna push him away, you know? Yeah, so just be more confident in yourself, honey. Yes, girl, you are beautiful. Look in the mirror and say, I am, I am beautiful. Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, so that's that. Guys, comment down below and give her some advice. Yes. But please, be nice. Keep it cute. Because a long time, we don't eat rice. So. Keep it cute or put it on mute, girl. Yes, ma'am. Anyways, guys, y'all already know what time it is. What time it is? We finished eating quick today. It's though, time for shout outs, girl. I was not feeling this um, spaghetti. This spaghetti tastes like no gaiety. There's a spa. It's a spa. No gaiety. No, there was no gaiety in it, girl. <laughs> okay, so let me see what I have. Yes, meow. Okay, so the first shout out goes to um actually this is a um birthday shout out Ooh. happy happy birthday to ashley watson oh girl ashley girl yeah happy birthday yeah hope you having an uh, you're having an amazing day hope you do something special today yes we yeah. um love and appreciate you for your support that you always show and keep doing your thing girl yes girl congrats to another year girl you shall live to see many mucho more yes, yes ma'am Shouts out to Leon Pleasant. Ooh, Leon, not the rhymes, girl. When I tell you, you are the most pleasantest person I know, girl. Listen, you are not rude. You are not ill-mannered, girl. You are very well groomed and grown. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Shouts out to Cookie ATL Wilson. Ooh, Cookie girl, girl, you was down in the ATL with all them girls and them all different kind of cookies, girl. The chocolate chip cookies, the macadamia cookies, girl. The white chocolate chip, girl. The red velvet cookies, honey. Which cookie are you? 
Shout out oh, to XOXO Ken Ken. Ooh, Ken Ken girl, XOXO girl. Love you, girl, honey. Honey, I love you. And last but not least, shout out to Mark Thompson. Ooh, Mark, not the Wahlberg, honey. Through, honey, Mr. Thompson, honey, Mr. Thompson. <laughs> Thompson. Listen, we love and appreciate yes. you guys so, so much. We're tuning in every single day. Yes, Make sure you like, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you'll be notified every time. Every time. time. A new video. Every single time, good girl. Ooh. Yes, ma'am. And as we always say, every day. Is it a day? So, say, same as my mind. Honey, slay with some low carb spaghetti, girl. Girl. And you know what the thing is too? You know what the other thing too? I drained it. But why it looks so like water is so... Girl, I don't know what's going on with this spigot, girl. We love and she appreciate not, you guys. Uh, we will see y'all in tomorrow's video. Yes, ma'am. Much love. One, two, three. What's up, buddy, Army? <laughs> okay, for real, for real. One, two. You said. You said one, two. Okay, what's the problem? I don't know. You said one, two, three. Weird. One, two, three. What's up, Betty Army? Welcome. No, stop. Quick, what's going on? <laughs> okay. <sighs> okay. One. <clears throat> <clears throat> One, two, three. What's up, Betty Army? Welcome to another MOOC. Body twins, body twins, body 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 twins, body twins, body twins, body 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 twins, body twins, body twins, body 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 twins.